Welcome to the English Box. Today we're talking about irregular plurals. The first irregular plural we're going to look at is person. We say one person or a person. And when there is more than one person, we say people. Three people, four people, a group of people, for example. We say one man. But we say a group of men when there is more than one man. Similarly, we say one woman and many women. Women is the plural of woman. For a child, we also have an irregular plural. We say one child and we say a group of children. Also, for some parts of the body, we have irregular plurals. We say one tooth, and we say many teeth, or a mouth full of teeth. We also say one foot, and two feet. For many different kinds of animals, we also have irregular plurals following a similar rule to tooth and teeth and foot and feet we also have goose and geese one goose two geese we also say one mouse and a group of mice similarly for those nasty little animals a louse and many lice you can have different types of lice. You can have hair lice that live in your hair, and you can have wood lice. Following a similar rule to child and children, we can also have ox and oxen, adding en in the plural. Some plurals don't change from their singular form. For example, fish in singular and fish in plural. I have one goldfish, I have many goldfish. Deer and deer, and sheep and sheep. You can't have three sheeps, you have three sheep. A little bit more complicated now, we have one bacterium, and many bacteria. Likewise, one medium, television is a medium, and you have many different kinds of media, newspapers, television, radio, the internet, all different types of media. Then we have one cactus, and there are many cacti in the desert. One stimulus, such as the bell, was the stimulus in the famous Pavlov experiment, and many stimuli. Colours can, can stimulate different emotions. There are different types of stimuli. One nucleus, the central point of something, normally the central point of a cell, the control center, many nuclei. One crisis, the financial crisis for example, and hopefully we won't have another financial crisis because then we'd have two financial crises. One oasis, two oases. And finally, mathematically, scientifically, one formula, and more than one formula is two, three formulae, an appendix, and the appendices. Okay, that brings us to the end of the video. Thank you very much for watching. Click on the panel on the left hand side to subscribe and on the right hand side to see a video about vocab um, and come and visit us at english.de for more videos or for lessons at englishbox.co.uk. Thanks for watching and goodbye.